Hi, I'm Hannah and I study science communication as a minor and I also do marketing and psychology. Um, I love the science communication paper, it's been super hands-on and we get to do lots of writing and filmmaking which is awesome. I did media at school and it transitioned really nicely. Supports my psych stuff and just super fun and it's a really small paper as well with psych and marketing. I found them really big and I was a really small part of that. Um, but with science communication, like a class of 27 or something and lecturers are really hands-on and it's just been an awesome paper to do. Hi, I'm Gianna Savoy. I'm the Director of Filmmaking at the Centre for Science Communication and I am super excited to tell you a little bit about our science communication minor that we offer through the, the Centre. And what that is, is basically a series of five papers that you can take um, as a complement to your course of study if you're doing humanities or if you're doing sciences and it's such a wonderful way to sort of fill out your resume and to get you jobs that really matter um, you know if you know looking around at the, the world today I and mean, we see science it, it you know impacts our lives in so many different ways and finding ways to tell stories about the science is really really key and we're seeing that every day <laughs> um, University of Otago is simply the best place to do this. I mean, if you just look around, we have literally the wildest classrooms on the planet. We've got our mountains and our glaciers and our, our rivers and, and wildlife. And you're just, you can be in touch with science in every aspect and really um, be able to tell the stories about it. So I am a scientist turned filmmaker and I so wish there was a program like this around when I was cutting my teeth in the industry. Um, so much of what the students do here is hands-on. They're working with industry professionals from all across um, the board, from people like who are authors to, uh, to web designers to filmmakers like myself. And uh, you know, it, that's really something special because there's very few programs I think that bring in the practical and the theoretical so beautifully and inter intertwine them so well and we do a great job of doing that for our students. Um, some of the projects that they've been involved in is they might be uh, authoring um, a series of blogs, they might be creating a whole website, uh, they may also be making a film about the wildlife we have around here. It's all really super exciting and um, you know students seem to get a lot out of it. Classes are really small, so uh, they get a lot of hands-on and personal time with their instructors. Science is part of our life in every way. And, um, you know, but science, though it has utility and function, without actually connecting to people and having a story, it really doesn't have that same meaning to people. So what we try to do is to, to, to create uh, storytellers of the science and to make them able to, to share the, the stories of the science happening around them. So one thing that we do here that, that really helps students um, is teach them practical skills that get them the job, right? So, um, you know, knowing a lot about science is really important if you're going into, into, a, into a career that has to do with science. But if you can add the fact that you can create a website or you could make a film or write a blog about the science and what's going on there, you've got a, a really, you know, heads up above the rest of, of the candidates vying for that same job. So it's something that's, you know, we really encourage in our students in, in helping them to um, get out there and to really create media that matters.